Hello, this is Louis D. Fresh bringing it to you on a Wednesday. Here we are doing another road trip to the neighborhood fish farm here in South Florida. Uh, we're just gonna let it roll, have a little fun, and see what we come up with. And so we have Caro, one of our, my dear friends. I've known her for about 10 years now. And we're serious, I have. And we are going to uh, feed some animals. Go ahead. Oop, it'd be nice if I turn the camera around. Yeah. Let's see. Hold on. Hi. There Hi. you are. Go ahead. Enlighten me. Oh, yes, we are feeding. What are we feeding again? The red tails and arowana. <laughs> this is the monster tank. You see the monster over there? All right, there. There we go. This is live and uh, in person. They love to eat. Oh my goodness! Don't we all? Uh, there we go. There you go. Look at all these beautiful fish. Oh my goodness. They're almost petting and scratching their noses. Oh my oh, god. Yeah. Well, I won't stick out my hand right now. I've gotten bit by these guys and it hurts. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> there you go. Good times. Good times. I have no more food for you guys. That's it. Se la fiesta. Yeah. There, much. there goes my Hispanicness. <laughs> anyway. We're still gonna edit that. I hate being a, I, even though it's a Okay, now we are back and we are checking out some peacock. Cichlids? Yeah. There we go. Over here, I love how these tanks are. You see how they are? All the tanks kind of look like this. You see the old tanks? I'm turning around, turning around. You see, you see, you see? And we are back. And enlighten me. What do we got? These are tangerine peacocks, or I think albino peacocks, if I'm not mistaken. Because oh. they have the eyes that are red, too. Very nice. Very but they're nice. beautiful. I love these guys. They are beautiful. They a little are. feisty, a little feisty, but beautiful. There you go. You remember from my uh, previous videos of Miami 305 cichlids, he had some cichlids. And so we have different perspective on cichlids here at the neighborhood fish farm here in South Florida. Ooh. And we're gonna stop. Again, we are here at the neighborhood fish farm in South Florida. And we are gonna check out some more fish. Remember, this is our road trip. Hold on. All right, we are back and we are showing me, showing the family, the YouTube family. We got... These are a pistol, a super red cockatoys. If I said that right. Ah, it doesn't matter. We're having a little fun. We're having a little fun here. And they're beautiful. I love these guys. They're a little aggressive for being dwarfs, but... They are pretty. Yeah. Look at the, look at the fins. Yeah, right? They're super nice. Those are males. Really, really nice. Look at them. that. They look good in like little semi-aggressive tanks. There you go. All right, now we are back and we are checking out some more fish. We are checking out freshwater flounder as my good friend Caro starts to explore. And this is something that I'm going to mention that you should go local. Whatever your local fish store is, go local. Nothing wrong with Petco's or Pet Smarts or any of that, but go with your local people. Get to know them. They are your friends. And here we are. Look at that bad boy. I love his eyes. Look, <laughs> look at her up there. Pobrecito. There, look at that. Oh, look God, at that. They're amazing. They're look, so cool. Again, my Cuban is coming out. Look at that. <laughs> good times. Good times. Look at that. You can almost pet them. Yeah? Yeah, man. They oh. have that sideways smile. That's very nice. <laughs> smile. Ever, we're all smiling. We're all smiling. Even through the mask, I am smiling at four minutes and one second into this lovely video. Back to our seriousness here at the fish farm in south florida with the music playing mm -hmm. uh we even though i'm gonna put some uh some background music on this but we'll keep it rolling well, that's a and snail. this is <laughs> an apple snail. that's an apple snail you see them in, in small in places that are like little small little snails that's how big they get but that's not what we're showing you we are showing you these tiger parrots tiger parrot what's he what's it tiger parrot look how cute oh my goodness they're not just nice they're cute they're look, adorable they're ad they don't get that big, but, but they're adorable. Are they aggressive? They're aggressive, yeah. They are. These yeah. are all freshwater since we are doing freshwater fish in the Louis D. Fresh production. Look at that. It's so cute. Okay, well, there yeah, you go. Everything aggressive. So Everything is aggressive. Aggressive. Aggressive fish are nice. What can we say? They're beautiful. They have such pretty colors. 
<laughs> All right. Once again, Louis D. Fresh. It looks like I'm going to go rob a bank, doesn't it? <laughs> anyway, uh, we are waiting for a beta fish to be uh, cleaned up so they can look all pretty for the, uh, for the camera. And what we're also doing is uh, I want to make sure that you remember uh, my video concerning uh, Beverly's Pet Center. At the very end of it, I did betas. And now I'm showing you some more betas. And remember last time, which was on the 31st of January, I showed you uh, Dendi, the breeder from uh, Indonesia. So uh, we're continuing with the little beta theme here. And I'll be right back. And now we're continuing and finishing up with betas. Remember on the 31st, I showed you of January, the uh, video with Dendi, the Indonesian beta uh, breeder. And on the 17th, with uh, Beverly's Pet Center betas. Now we're gonna go here to uh, the neighborhood fish farm betas. Okay, we are back here and they are showing us, our good friend Caro is showing us, and by the way, quick quick mud skipper. Oh, yeah. it little, little mud skipper. Anyway, I'll be, <laughs> I, I digress. You can tell we're just having some fun. This is so pretty. If it decides to show itself. Look at that. Wow, look at the colors, look at the. Ooh. Oh, look, he showed himself. Okay, cool. Easy. He's like, I'm on camera. <laughs> good stuff, man. Good stuff. There's so many different colors. There's like blues and greens. and. Look how nice. These are all available to you over here at the neighborhood. <laughs> She's shaking her head. Neighborhood Fish Farm here in South Florida. And I will also put on the on the little thing their website and all that fun so you can check them out. These are koi betas, but I don't think you, the cups don't do them justice that you can see them. Like, really appreciate them. Let me see. Maybe there. There he is. There oh, there, a little bit there. You can see them from the top view, too, because they look really nice, too. There he is. There he is. All oh, right. Koi betas. They look so pretty. Oh, because I bend down a little bit. Here we go. I can't see him. There we go. Now I see him. Say hi. Say hi to the people. He's waving his fins. Yes, he is. Look at look that. He's so nice. He is pur pretty, 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 pretty. A half moon koi beta, beautiful. Hey, beautiful. Yes. And we are gonna finish up our video and thank Gato for, uh, and we'll, hold on, stand up there. Eh? I will definitely be back here. Uh, and tomorrow I have another road trip. So always say hi to your local pet shop. Yep. And I thank you. Have a great day. Neighborhood Fish Farm in South Florida. Thank you.